Hey guys, in this video we'll take a look at how to create these shots and make yourself small. To achieve this we'll use just a few simple effects in Adobe After Effects. Let's get started. So this is the first scene we're gonna recreate. First we need to get a background shot. For the next shot I'm gonna use a green screen and just sit on the chair. That's all we need for this scene, so let's fire up After Effects. Place your background shot on the bottom of the timeline. And the green screen shot goes on top of that. First I'll rotate and scale the video. Now let's create a mask. Grab the pen tool and draw a shape around the body. Now we need to remove the green screen, so search for key light effect. Use color picker to select the green color and adjust screen matte settings. Then choose intermediate result. To remove the green spill apply advanced spill suppressor effect to the green screen layer. We can also use Mesh Warp effect to match the perspective a bit better. Now let's add some shadows. Create a black solid. And draw a mask. Then change the blending mode to overlay. Next, decrease the opacity and feather the mask. Now just duplicate the black solid and repeat the same process to add more shadows. Lastly, duplicate the green screen layer, make it 3D and rotate it in perspective to create another shadow on the ground. Then add some blur using fast blur effect. And use tint effect to colorize the shadow. And that's it. Let's take a look at another scene where I am climbing out of the pumpkin. Again we need two shots, a background shot and a green screen shot. As you can see I used a black box to keep my legs higher. I already placed the shots on the timeline. To start off select the green screen layer and create a mask around the green screen. The next step is removing the green screen. Alright, once this is ready, let's make the layer 3D and flip it. Now carefully reposition and scale the clip. I think this looks accurate. So how do we get the body inside of the pumpkin? Actually, it's very simple. Just duplicate the background layer and move it to the top. All you need to do is select the pen tool and draw a mask around the outside of the pumpkin. Additionally, adjust the position of the green screen layer and it's looking pretty good. To match the lighting, add curves effect to the green screen layer and decrease the brightness. Finally, we can add a reflection on the ground. Duplicate the green screen layer and rotate it to match the perspective. Next, just blur it out and reduce the opacity. To top it all off, you can add an adjustment layer on top of everything and color grade the whole scene. And we are done. 
Also comment down below what you think about these tricks and if you like this tutorial please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one.